If you've had the fortune that I have, you have witnessed Amanda and Steve meet from a romantic comedy worthy friendship to a falling deeply in love. Steve first caught Amanda's eye with his athletic prowess playing hacky sack, which drew her irresistibly to him, after which she pitched Steve to come to one of her new hacky hour sessions and share information on his new project. When he arrived, he found out that Amanda had in fact made him a guest speaker unbeknownst to him. Part of this conundrum was no doubt the fact that she used to have a penchant for the, and I quote, dumb pretty ones. Um, when in fact Steve, as we know, was a gentleman and a scholar. No doubt this was her subconscious telling her that this guy was, in fact, the one. Stephen, as a parent watching your child grow up, you, um, you worry about how they'll go and, and I must say I'm very proud of the man you've become, the person you've become. That played no small part in my growing up and more importantly it allowed me to grow up with your son, my brother, whom I look up to and respect an immeasurable amount. Um, for me that was all close but it didn't quite hit the mark. The first time I met her it was like being welcomed home family member that I didn't know I had accepting me into their life. From the moment you were born, you held my little finger. Since then, you've grown to be a strong, independent and young woman. The world is as it should be, with Steve and Amanda committing to each other forever more. You come to this marriage, not with the expectation that the other will make you whole, but rather with the belief that together the opportunities are limitless. We trust in their love, their friendship and their commitment to one another. We know they will be there for each other, they will be loyal and spend the rest of their lives growing and learning together. Ask everyone present to witness that I, Stephen, take you, Amanda, with my whole heart as my lawfully wedded wife, and I happily join my life to yours. I see these vows not as promises, but as privileges. There's only one you, and you chose me. I want to marry you, not only just to wake up together every morning and for all the good times, but because sometimes life will be bumpy and hard, and even through those tough times, travelling with you will be worth every minute. Amanda, I give you this ring. Stephen, as you wear this ring. As a symbol of my love. Remember how much I love you. And pride that you are my wife. Not only on this special day, but every day of your life. I couldn't ask for a better husband for Amanda. In the short time that we've known you, uh, you've become part of our family and we love you so much. Thank you Amanda and Stephen for being in our lives and for being two of the most intelligent, honest and caring people that I have the pleasure of having in my life. If you want a happy marriage, do everything Amanda tells you. <laughs> or, or like Nono says, happy wife is a happy life. Uh, and I can finally call this amazing woman my wife. the first time you threw me in front of a crowd to speak. I should have known you'd have me up here again somehow. <laughs> I look forward to our life 
love and shared calendar more than ever. <laughs> Make one of them smile. Laugh. And continue to adventure together for many years to come. <laughs>